Hello and welcome to this demonstration video where I will show you two ways to update the firmware in the Borsen RTU32. The first way is to use the RTU32 remote update tool. The second way is to take out the flashcard of the RTU32, put it in a card reader and simply copy the new firmware files to the flashcard. First I will start by using the RTU32 remote update tool. With this tool you can update multiple RTU32s in one click. You can also update the Straton uh, program in the RTU. First I'll start by searching for my RTU in the network. This one, enter table, then I'll select firmware, select the path, and then put in the FTP user and the password and we'll select reboot the RTU32 after the firmware update is finished. We'll check update and then press now we start updating the RTU32. Now the RTU has rebooted and we'll just go into the web page and see if it has been updated. Now you'll see we have to type in a new password. For the admin user, I'll just do this. We'll do a reboot again. So now we'll see our new version is 1.10.14, the old one was 1.10.12. Now I'll show you the second way. I've just taken out the flashcard of my RTU32. I'll put it into a card reader. Then I'll take delete all files. Yes. Then open a new then I'll just select the flash, select all files, copy, and then simple copy it to the flashcard. Simply remove the flashcard, put it back into the RTU32 and power it up. And then go into the web page and verify that the firmware has been updated to 1.10.14. Just close this one. Now it's ready. I log in. Yes, I have to type in my password. A new password, then I know it has been updated. Just wait a bit till it has been saved. 
the new password and we can check the firmware version see 1.10.14 so it has been updated thank you this was all for now goodbye